Welcome to a journey to Nepal, the land of the Himalayas, where adventure awaits you at every corner. Buckle up as we take you through 10 fascinating facts about this incredible country that will make you want to climb Everest. Are you ready to explore? Let's go. Did you know that Nepal is home to eight of the world's 10 tallest mountains? Yes, you heard that right. Out of the 14 peaks that are over 8,000 meters high, eight of them proudly stand in Nepal. The most famous of them all is Mount Everest, the tallest mountain in the world, reaching a staggering 848 meters. But it's not just Everest that captures hearts. Mountains like Lhotse, Makalu, and Kanchenjunga also boast majestic heights and stunning views. These towering giants are not just mountains, they are legends that call out to adventurers from around the globe. Now you might be wondering, what makes Nepal's mountains so special? It's not just their height. The Himalayas are known for their breathtaking beauty and the unique experiences they offer. Imagine waking up to the sight of snow-capped peaks glowing in the sunrise, the crisp mountain air filling your lungs, and the sound of prayer flags fluttering in the wind. It's a scene straight out of a dream. Plus, trekking in Nepal offers a variety of trails, from easy walks in the hills to challenging climbs up steep paths, ensuring that there's something for everyone, whether you're a seasoned climber or a beginner. Here's a fun fact for you. Mount Everest has two main climbing routes, the South Coal Route in Nepal and the North Coal Route in Tibet. Most climbers choose the South Coal Route, which is known for its relatively easier access and the legendary base camp at the foot of the Khumbu Icefall. This route not only offers a safer climb, but also takes you through the vibrant culture of the Sherpa people, who have lived in the mountains for centuries and are known for their incredible mountaineering skills. Speaking of the Sherpa people, did you know that the word Sherpa is often used to refer to someone who guides climbers up the mountains? But Sherpa is actually an ethnic group native to the most mountainous regions of Nepal, particularly the Solukumbu region. The Sherpas are renowned for their remarkable ability to thrive at high altitudes and their exceptional mountaineering expertise. They've been an integral part of every successful Everest expedition, helping climbers with their local knowledge, strength and resilience. Without the Sherpas, many climbs would simply not be possible. But Nepal isn't just about its mountains. This country is a treasure trove of culture and history. Did you know that Nepal is the birthplace of Buddha? That's right, Siddhartha Gautama, who later became known as Buddha, was born in Lumbini, Nepal in 563 BCE. Lumbini is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and a place of pilgrimage for Buddhists from around the world. Visitors to Lumbini can explore ancient ruins, visit beautiful monasteries and meditate in peaceful gardens, all while soaking in the spiritual atmosphere of this sacred place. Now, let's talk about something delicious. Have you ever tried Nepali cuisine? If not, you're in for a treat. Nepal's food is as diverse as its landscape and culture. One of the most popular dishes is dal bhat, a meal consisting of lentil soup, rice and a variety of vegetables and curries. It's the staple food for most Nepali people and provides the energy needed for those long treks. Another favorite is momos, which are delicious dumplings filled with meat or vegetables and served with spicy dipping sauce. They're the perfect snack after a day of exploring. And don't forget to try sel roti, a traditional sweet rice bread that's crispy on the outside and soft on the inside. Yum! Nepal is also famous for its festivals, which are vibrant, colorful and filled with joy. One of the most celebrated festivals is Dashain, which is the longest and the most significant festival in the Nepalese calendar. It celebrates the victory of good over evil and involves days of family gatherings, animal sacrifices and kite flying. Another important festival is Tihar, also known as the Festival of Lights, which honors various animals, including crows, dogs and cows, and culminates in a grand celebration of brothers and sisters. During Tihar, homes are decorated with oil lamps and colorful rangoli patterns, making the nights as bright as the days. Have you ever heard of the living goddess? In Nepal, there's a unique tradition of worshipping a living goddess called the Kumari. The Kumari is a young girl who is believed to be the human incarnation of the Hindu goddess Taleju. She is chosen from the newer community in Kathmandu and is worshipped until she reaches puberty, after which a new Kumari is selected. The Kumari lives in a palace called the Kumari Gar in Kathmandu Durbar Square, and she makes occasional public appearances during festivals and important ceremonies. Seeing the Kumari is considered a blessing and it's a tradition that fascinates both locals and tourists alike. Nature lovers, this one's for you. Nepal is not only about towering peaks, but also lush jungles and diverse wildlife. 
The country has several national parks and wildlife reserves where you can see animals like tigers, rhinos and elephants. One of the most famous parks is Chitwan National Park, a UNESCO World Heritage Site which offers exciting jungle safaris. Imagine riding on an elephant through the dense forest, spotting a one-horned rhinoceros, or even catching a glimpse of the elusive Bengal tiger. It's an adventure that will make you feel like you're in a real-life jungle book. Have you ever wondered what it feels like to fly? Well, in Nepal, you can experience just that. Paragliding in Pokhara is an adventure that should be on every thrill-seeker's bucket list. Pokhara is known for its stunning lakes and mountain views, and paragliding here offers a bird's-eye view of this incredible landscape. As you glide through the sky, you'll have the Annapurna mountain range on one side and the beautiful Fiwa Lake below you. It's a surreal experience that gives you a sense of freedom and exhilaration like no other. Another curious fact, Nepal has a unique flag. Unlike the rectangular flags of most countries, Nepal's flag is made up of two triangular shapes stacked on top of each other. These triangles symbolize the Himalayas and the two major religions of Nepal, Hinduism and Buddhism. The flag's crimson red color represents bravery and the blue border symbolizes peace. It's a flag that proudly represents the country's identity and heritage. Last but not least, let's talk about the friendly people of Nepal. Nepali people are known for their warmth and hospitality. No matter where you go, you'll be greeted with smiles and open arms. The phrase Atithi Devo Bhava, which means the guest is God, is deeply ingrained in the culture. Whether you're staying in a luxurious hotel or a humble guest house, you'll always feel welcome. The locals are eager to share their stories, traditions, and a cup of warm tea with you. In conclusion, Nepal is a country of wonders, from its towering mountains and rich culture to its delicious food and friendly people. Whether you're an adventurer looking to climb the highest peaks, a history buff eager to explore ancient sites, or someone simply looking for a beautiful place to relax and enjoy nature, Nepal has something for everyone. So pack your bags, lace up your hiking boots, and get ready to embark on an unforgettable journey. Who knows, you might just find yourself standing on the top of the world, looking down at the vast expanse of beauty that is Nepal. Happy travels.